Hey guys, Hail Scott here with another uh, video. Today I'm going to do my everyday carry. Um, this is what I carry every day. Um, to my preferences, other people carry other stuff. Uh, <clears throat> I'm in and out of a truck all day. I do deliveries, so I like to not have too many things that are going to be making me bend, uh, be uncomfortable, whatever. So I keep it minimal. Um, First thing I carry, obviously, everybody's got to carry a wallet. Um, I got a crappy old wallet. Um, it is crappy, but I made this in the sixth grade, so I will live with it. Uh, I've had a dog chew on it. I've had it go through the washer multiple times. It's a little dry right now. I got to put some oil on there, but I made this about 20 years ago. So for 20 years of use, it's still holding up, and I do like it. Um, Next up, my car keys and my house keys. I keep them separate because if you ever have to get out of the car in a hurry, um, you don't want to rip your key out. I always carry separate keys um, or if it's running and I want to run out. Um, kind of cool here. I shot a computer processor with a 9mm bullet, um, an AMD processor. And the bullet stuck in there. This is about five, six years ago and it's still in there. So I drilled a hole in it and... Um, now my house key chain so don't nobody copy my car keys or my house key because well you ain't gonna get my car because it's got multiple alarms but anyways yep so got that in a car key um a couple different knives i carry they're both kershaw's um one's a brawler one's a leak um mainly depends on what i'm gonna do for the day the thickness is what i choose so if I'm uh, going to be around the warehouse or not doing too much, I'll carry the brawler. If I'm going to go out, I'll carry the leak, uh, Kershaw leak. Both great knives. Um, the spring, I've had these so long and I've used them so much. Both of the spring assisted, whatever, are there are no more. Um, so you literally got to, you know, get it out yourself. Um, I don't really care. They're beat up knives. Um, they, they're sharp. They do everything i need them to do so why buy a new one maybe uh, actually today is my birthday maybe i'll get one for my birthday highly doubt it but you never know um i carry a flashlight this is an inexpensive light um i don't even know what it is um something i got at probably lowe's or home depot um right now it's super bright outside so you can't really tell but it's got an adjustment you can um pull it for a more round pattern or suck it in and it's a little more direct or vice versa um i carry a what is it a phobus paddle holster um i don't like it but for these mags it works well um they have these stupid extensions on them and actually i usually used to take them off but yeah so i carry two full size 17 round magazines for my sr9c um most importantly, because not not to have the extra amount of ammo if you need it, but if you have a bad magazine, um, if you're in a gunfight and your magazine's shot and it won't cycle around, um, you, you know, instead of fighting with a magazine, you just throw that one away and you grab another one. Um, usually I actually don't carry it with these things on there. I just carry them normal, but um, I just have them on here just to show you. And then I carry SR9C. Um, I always carry outside the waistband. Um, and this is actually a holster for a XD subcompact. Um, it's a Black Hawk. I like it because you can pop it off and on your belt real easily. And I also like how it, the retention, the thumb break. I mean, it's super nice. When you break this... Um, let me switch hands here. When you break this with your thumb, it's like right there for the safety. So you can drop the safety and break it all in one move. So I really like that, um, for this firearm. Uh, it is loaded right now, so I am going to be fairly safe with it. Um, you can see, so I carry a 10 rounder in there without the pinky may or pinky extension just for concealability. But... If uh, this has a magazine disconnect, so if you pull the mag, it's not going to fire. But so, if I needed a larger capacity, these 17 rounders fit right in, and now it's a full size grip. So that's that's kind of why I carry this one. Um, not to mention that at any given time, I got 17 plus 17 plus 10 rounds on me at all times. So 
almost 50 rounds. I think that's sufficient to get away from a threat or to neutralize um, a threat if need be. Uh, some people say 50 rounds too much, or I carry 45 because I only need eight rounds. Well, that's you. I'd rather I'd rather walk into a gunfight with 47 rounds and come out with um, come out with rounds than needing a round. So that's what I do. Now in the summertime, when it gets a little hotter, I carry inside the waistband with this little Galco leather-like holster. Um, I recommend this for guns with say a stainless steel slide and a polymer frame like this because this if you sweat this will retain moisture and your gun will rust um, uh, I carry my LC9S also in this in the summertime or as a backup and it does definitely rust so I gotta clean my slide probably every other day um, just for that so I recommend with this holster uh, stainless steel or something that's not very corrosive um, now in the summertime when I do have to wear a little less clothes because it's so hot I carry my LC 9s um, outside the waistband which is kind of weird for somebody to carry a subcompact um, outside the waistband but I do a lot of bending like say I deliver stuff so it is hard to carry inside the waistband all the time um, this is a Ruger holster. I do not recommend this holster at all. Um, I'll tell you exactly why. So unlike unlike my SR9C holster, you see where the strap goes around the back of the slide? So when you go to grab your gun, you can get a grip on it, break it. You can get a good grip on it. You know, that's not even the best grip, but you can get high up on the gun and break it. This gun, you cannot grab it. When you grab it, wh where are you grabbing? You're grabbing over the strap. So when you break that, look, uh, it's still around the firearm. It makes it incredibly hard to pull out. So I do not recommend this holster. Um, this is straight from Ruger. Um, I wish I could take it back and just have him make another one where the strap goes around the back of the slide versus right there. So just note to self, uh, don't I, I don't recommend this holster I've gotten used to it so I do carry it but I don't recommend it um, and it's hard to find a subcompact holster also when I carry that I also carry um, two spare mags these are unloaded right now because it's not summertime so I don't have I don't I haven't carried this in a couple months um, I do carry two spare mags be just because it's single stack so you always want to have extra mags. It ain't the ammo always. You just need the mags. Just in case the one in your gun fails, you have another one. So that's my everyday carry. Um, what's yours, guys? If you have any comments or anything like that, let me know. And I hope you liked the video. Um, be sure to subscribe if you liked it. Thanks for watching. Hail Scott out.